made by Uni Okami. Welcome back again guys, notice here, and for today we are going to play Born Dion. I don't know how to spell it. Obsession. Anyway, let's start the game. Now, Roger, please choose your name before you begin. <sighs> okay, fine, I'm gonna start with my name. No, really. Yeah, no, the sushi. See it. Anyway, ugh. Okay. My head hurts. It's really cold. It's really cold. Hey, wh wh where are we? Where am I? This place looks like a basement. It is a basement. What happened with me? Why am I here? Why, why am I in here? Where am I? Where I am? You quickly discover that you l your legs are tied to this chair, to the chair, and your hands are tied behind your back. What? What the hell? Scream! Wait! Silence! Struggle! I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save here. Oh, <laughs> how many endings with this game? Let me see. Let me see. I cannot. I cannot help it. Help! No, oh, come on. This program contains free software under a number of licenses. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Hmm. Yeah. Okay, I guess I can. I won't be able to figure out what it is. Now, what if I scream? You know what? I ran out of option. Help! Anyone there? Please, I'm down here. I need help. You look around trying to see if there is anything that can help you break free. There must be something. The room is kind of empty. Just some boxes and drawers that I can't reach anyway. Why can't I remember what the hell happened with me? After some time, you hear footsteps coming toward, toward the room. These steps. Maybe it is the police? You sure it's the police? I don't think so. The door opened with a loud click and someone enters. Uh-oh. And now, I already awake. I will be honest. I didn't expect you to wake up so soon. And what did you expect me to do? But it is good. I was tired of waiting. Who are you? Yeah, who are you, man? And what are you doing in this basement? Are you a kidnapper? Why am I, I am tied? Why am I tied? What did you do to me? You begin struggling once more in an attempt to escape and break free. You are scared, aren't you? I won't harm you if you act properly, so don't be so scared. What the hell? Let me go. You start to struggle again. God, you look like a helpless puppy right now. What the hell is wrong with this guy? Fuck, what did you want? My wallet, my credit card. Oh, where are they? Where are my belongings, man? Uh, oh, it's so fairy. I love that about you, Nori. Okay. What do I want? Isn't that obvious, Nori? What is it? What? You, uh, you want me. And that's not a way to tell a person that you want them by kidnapping them. What are you talking about? I already said, I want you. I want to have you. Uh, I will scream so loudly that everyone will hear me if you don't let me go. Go ahead, scream. I am the only one who will hear you. Nobody is going to save you. Ah, uh, what are you talking about? The nearest form is 10 kilometers away. The nearest form? Heck, man, what do, where did you bring me? In the jungle? You will stay here. Uh huh, I'm, 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 not, I'm not planning to stay here. Are you crazy? I don't even know you. Oh, you don't remember me? 
Yes, I don't remember you, man, and I don't even know who you are. You and your kitty cat ears. I think I hate you a little too hard, or maybe you just didn't care. Really? And see, and yes, I might be crazy, so what? It's not important. What matters is that you are mine now, whether you like it or not. Okay, you are a psychopath, whether you like it or not. I'm gonna save. Return. Let me go try to attack him. There's no point in attacking him. Angry, you try to strike head, his head with yours. You collapse with the chairs on the floor as he quickly takes a step back. You okay, motherfucker, man. Language, Nori. You okay? Along with this chair, he pushes you back into the proper position. Look at you. Look at you. Trying to be as spicy as a hissing cat. Uh huh. You look so cute while you are trying so hard to be tough. But the reality is, you are just a helpless, adorable puppy. That he attempt to soften strike, stroke your ear, your ear, but you hit his hand, causing him to bleed. Fuck. You little. You are so ungrateful. Don't make me teach you a lesson, Noi. Oh, what are you gonna do if I don't listen to you? I'm trying to be nice, you know. You are making this hard. And you are a lady starting to annoy me. What uh, if I annoy you more? You deserve it. Who do you think you are? When people will notice that I'm gone, they'll look for me. I think I smacked you quite hard. Really? What do you mean? You don't seem to remember. Your parents are aboard on business, Nori. Oh, okay. You live alone. And your fake good for nothing friends. Won't even bother looking for you. Why, I can't remember anything. Maybe he's just trying to play with my brain. Maybe he's lying to manipulate me. All you need to do is learn how to act appropriately. Then we will both be able to understand one another. Okay, Nori? Well, I, I do not think so, man. Coming soon? What is that? I'm gonna save. Coming soon. I wanna know what is this. Oh, come on. Oh, uh, the game is still updating. Okay, okay, okay. Fine. Okay, I'll act appropriately. For now. Excellent. Being calm and calm and obedient makes you much cuter. Oh, I don't think I'm cuter, man. Well, that wasn't so difficult, was it? A lot of respect doesn't hurt anyone. What about a little of anger? Or some freedom? For now, I have to play along with the crazy, with this crazy freak. I have no idea what he is capable of. Do as I say when I say, and no one will get hurt. That's the deal. You understand? I do not think so, man. Yes, I understand. This is so stupid. Why me? Where do you know me from? Why did you bring me here? Yeah, I have all these questions also. Why, why you? I was interested in you. That's all. Really? You got me, you got my attention. I've been following you for a while. Okay. I know a lot about you. This guy is a complete psychopath and creep. <laughs> Even though he is good looking. And you already know me. Mm -hmm, too bad you forgot about me. Or didn't care enough. How can I know this guy? If we know each other, why did he do that? 
Is he my enemy or something? Maybe something like that. I we don't know. Let's see. Relax. I will take a good care of you. Uh, let me save. Action. The mute is way low. Okay. Uh, what's your name? Did we... Did you say we know each other? What's your name? So what's your name? My name, I guess... You'd like to know my name, hmm. Why do you want to know my name, darling? Are you already that eager to know me? Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm just playing your game, man. No, but I am going to be here for a while. I need to at least know your name, I guess. I guess. So I can tell the police your name and put you behind bars. Yeah, that's another that's the consult you have. Alright. You're yeah, right. If you know my name, my name, I think it would be easier for you to call me. Very well. My name is Lumu. Remember it well. Lumu or Lunu? Lunu. I'm gonna call you Lunu. Do I know someone with this name? I don't remember anything. My mind is blank. Now you know my name. Happy? Well, not really. Do you remember me now, Nori? Nope. Oh, well, I suppose it was... It will take some time. So, when are you going to let me go? Let you go? I don't think you understand, Nori. You'll be here with me forever. Come on. You can't be serious. I'm not a fish in a bowl. Yeah, we are a fish in a bowl or uh, some toy you can play whenever you want. I am a human being. You will be free again. One day. Huh? Okay, one minute that. I don't even remember. I don't know. Is he really serious? There is no way this is happening to me. Suddenly, his phone buzzes. Listen, I'm a little busy at the moment. But don't worry. I'll be back in few hours. Okay. Until then, be a good puppy and don't do anything stupid. Wait, hold on. Are you serious? Are you going to keep me tied up here for hours? Um, yes. What if I have to lie down or if I need to go to the toilet? Yeah, you can't leave me here. Like this. Indeed, but I still can't untie you. Wait, what? If you need to use the bathroom, wait until I return. And you are young enough to spend a couple hours in the chair. Don't worry, I just need to fix some issues. You need to fix some issues? And what kind of issue? Kidnapping another woman? When I will return home, I will make you something good to eat. Okay... Something to eat. I can't believe this guy. What if he, if he never returns? Is he going to let me root in this basement? Oh, don't worry. Soon I'll be back. He, came close, he, came, he comes closer to you and lightly touches your cheek. Be good puppy, okay? Hmm, okay. Good. He smiles softly at you before locking the basement door, leaving you alone. You take a deep breath and make sure he's gone. This creep is crazy. I need to get out of here. Yeah, we do need to get out of here. Despite your best effort to break free from the rope and chair, you, cl you collapse on the cold floor, on the cold floor, with the sh with the chair. Ugh. I need to find something sharp. Yeah, something sharp. I need to cut the rope. You attempt to move, jump, or crawl, but it's all in vain. I guess nothing is happening for us. I mean, nothing's good working. I mean, nothing working for us. From all the people in the world, why me? It's so cold in here. Are we going to sleep? Maybe I should give up. 
There is no point in freeing myself from the from this rope. No, I can't give up yet. He is simply insane, and perhaps I can escape if I play my cards well. Oh, come on. Let's see. A small window. There is a small window. A few boxes and shelves. Yeah, shelf. A light bulb. A bed behind me. A small room with toilets. I wonder what's in those boxes. Hmm. I think I may have an idea. Wait for him and make him and tell you. Try to go to the boxes. Let's save. I'm being rebellious here. If I force myself to crawl to those boxes, perhaps I can reach them. But I've tried before. You know what? Never give up. You try your best to reach the boxes. After an hour, you are able to approach the boxes. How do I open them? Well, I'm stupid. This is struggle. This struggle is all for nothing. Lini walks into the room at the door. Okay. Unlocks. What the hell are you doing? I told you to stay and stealth. For once, can you listen to me? Well, sorry, I can't, man. I think it's time to teach you a lesson. Uh-oh. Wait, hold on. Wait, what? What are you doing? Teach you a lesson. I told you, you are going to be in trouble if you keep disobeying me. I'm going to cra to crave my intentional into your skin. Initial. You are fucking crazy, man. So everyone will know you are... You belong to me. What? Are you crazy? Wait, wait, wait. I'm sorry. I was called. I was hoping, hoping to find some sort of blanket. Ah, oh, yeah, sorry and regretful now. Don't you think it's a little bit late for this? Oh, okay, this. Besides, I think it's well, it will look good on you. He grabs your chain, tilting your head to the side. And press the cold blade to your neck. Wait, wait. Please forgive me. This is the last time I will disobey you. I swear. Fine. Okay, at least he is believing us now. I guess this is the last time I will let it, I will let it slide. I will hold back because I don't want to hurt you, Nori. Don't ever do that again. Okay, he's like, what? You're so annoying. I think that's one thing I like about you. And so much more. Really? God, you are d divine. You are so lucky that I love you. Really? You are a narcissist and like what? You're lucky, maybe caused. <laughs> Hold it, Nori. Don't upset him again. Anyway. I wanted to prepare a good meal for you, but you didn't listen to me, so I think I will get you something to fill your stomach for now. I wanted to treat you nice, but uh, here we are again. Any food is good, a bed. I'm going to bring you food now. Don't move. I'm serious this time. Okay, fine. I won't move. He went upstairs, closing the door behind him. This crazy bastard, craving his initial into my neck with a knife. I'm not a god, a goddamn tree. What the hell? Mm, struggle and escape, stay still. Uh, what if I, I'm gonna say? No, 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 no. Um, here. Stay here, it's on. Stay still, struggle. Struggle and escape. I can't stand this jerk anymore. I really need to escape now. This food stings your skin as you try to get right of it. This is trash. You keep struggling, but the raw flesh feels tighter and sharper. Huck. I need to get right of this rope. What the hell are you doing? You really can't stall for a few seconds. You can't. Sit still. You are so damn stupid. 
he walks behind you, touching your hand. I idiot. Ah, Ben, you are so dumb. Sometimes. Ah, okay, unfortunate. Look what you did. I wonder how the hell you survived all these years alone. I'm dirty because of you now. I can't believe you actually hurt yourself. Well, I cannot help it. Do you really want me to punish you? A human associate or an idiot? Um, either way, I just wanna run away from you, man. He walks behind you and cleans your wounds. Stay still. I will clean up this mess for you. It hurts. No shit, Sherlock. <laughs> I told you to stay still and quiet. And quit. You are a mess. Don't do that again, okay? I don't want you to get hurt. And you can't escape those ropes. I practiced it for years. To make sure you can't escape. Seriously, man. So please, don't try again. <sighs> okay. Whatever. Amazing. He has been practicing all these years. How to kidnap me. How romantic. How romantic. You know... Went upstairs again, this time leaving the door open. I can't even untie myself. I can't climb the stairs either. I just kill... Just kill me already. After a few... After a while, he returns. I hope you are hungry. I cooked something nice for you. But you won't get it because you were bad. So you get this. Or this. Bread. Okay, at least. This is good also. Not bad. Bread and milk and almond. Let's feed you so I can give you a little gift later. A gift? What kind of gift? You will see. Mm, okay. I'm kind of a little, a little bit exciting. Now open your mouth and say, ah, uh, ah, uh, no. Okay, okay. Just eat. You can't eat alone anyway. So just accept my help. You take a bite of the bread. Is the bread soft, dear? Yeah, it is soft. I think it's better if you dip it in the in the milk. I know you like warm soft bread. Hmm, can you stop saying creepy things? You don't know me. No. I also, I think I know you better than anyone else. In society, we behave differently than we are. The people we communicate with don't know us for real. If you start watching people when they are alone, you'll notice how different they behave. When they think they are alone, that's when you see the real person. Hmm, because they are not judged and... They don't have to act nice anymore. And if... Whatever. Uh-oh. Okay. Also, I know almonds are one of your favorites. Meh. They are okay. Um... Okay, is there something wrong? Oh, is he crying? Oh, come on. What? I... I thought... I thought they were your favorite. You always bought a few on the way home. Not really. When I bought the soda, they gave me a free bag of almonds. Some marketing move, I guess. Or partnership. Is he crying? What the hell? Why are you crying, man? I am so sorry. I didn't know. I just saw the almonds in your bag and... I won't make the same mistake. Oh, how sensitive you are. I'll pay more attention. Besides that, 
Now I can talk to you. Mm, okay. Ask you what you like. Find out everything you like. After a while, you finish eating and he put the plate away. Now, it's time for the promised reward. Aha, uh -huh, Lini walks behind you, reaching for a small gift box. Let's see. There it, there it is. There it is. Well, as I said, I have a reward for you. What, what's the reward you have, man? What's in that? Okay. What's in it? Really? What the? What in the? Do you like it? If you put this on and allow me to cuff one hand without making any trouble, you are free to walk around the basement. Use the bed and toilet as well. Seriously? I want you to feel comfortable in your new home. And if you sit in that chair too long, you might turn into a stat statue. So, will you wear it? I'm gonna save and be rebellious again. No. I won't wear this garbage. I won't wear it, man. Wear it. Why not? It's a special made for you. Special made for you? Titanium lock. I'm not a pet. I know, I know. You are not a pet. You are my lover. Your lover? However... I have to make sure you don't escape. Oh, come on. Give me, man. I said I'm not wearing this. Then you prefer me to break your legs, so... <gasps> no. You can't escape. I hell no, man. Yes, that's what I thought. I, oh, oh. Yeah, we're gonna wear it. Fine. You can, you can have what you want. Okay, let's see. You know, walk behind you. And attach the collar to your neck, then locks it. You notice that the chain he intends to tie around your hand. I might have a chance. Do you know slowly untie the rope around your hands? I'm planning to do all kind of bad things. <sighs> Attack him. That's my chance. After he unties your legs and tries to untie your hand rope, you stand up from the chair and push him into the ground. <laughs> Look at him. Hug. You try to hit him, but he defends himself with his arms. Feeling irritated, he punches you in the stomach, making you fall down. I try to run, but the chain collar is still around your neck. No, <laughs> you will pay for this. He holds you down to the ground by standing over you. I told you to obey me. I gave you a chance to go to be good. I'm tired of to be the good guy. What would you need to you need to do, man? You know, hold you down as he stab you in the show. Oh, freaking kidding, man. Oh, he's crazy. My shoulders oh, bleeding. I feel the blade of the knife inside my shoulder. Quiet. You deserve this. I wanted us to be happy. I wanted us to be in love. I gave you so many chances. But I guess you will never love me. Punch him. You take a deep breath and try to ignore the pain in your shoulder. Then you hit him with your other arm. Still fighting me. God, you really are a stubborn brat. Let me tell you something. Your, your only reason for you to be alive was to be mine. But now... You have no reasons to be alive anymore, do you? Uh, what are you? Don't. You're gonna kill us. No, I won't kill you. I'll, but I will make sure you never walk again in this. Kidding me? I can't breathe. 
you are dead. The end, bad end, number one. Ah,、uh, unfortunate. We died. Thanks for playing. Wait in silence. Struggle. What if I struggle? This stupid rope. You start to struggle and attempt to release your hands, but they are too tight, tightly bound. Ugh, this is useless. You look around, trying to see if there is anything that can be helped. You break free. There must be something. The room is kind of empty. Just some boxes, drawers that I can't reach anyway. Why can't I remember what the hell happened? Ah,、uh, skip. Try to attack him. Let me go. Wait, 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 wait. Ah,、uh, damn it! I have to some time. You hear the footsteps are coming toward the room. Okay, okay. Maybe it's the police. Door open. Oh yeah, there he is. You already awake. I'll be honest. Didn't expect you to walk in so soon, but it's good. It's the same dialogue. Hating, who are you, man? Why am I tied? What did you do? Okay, okay. It's skipping. Let me go. Try to attack him. Okay, let me go. Angry, you look at him with the hatred in your eyes. Let's let me go. You are a freak. But no, he. You don't get to decide. You need to get used to the idea. What idea, man? What is ah、oh, the idea of staying with you? Please, I just want to go home. I won't tell anyone. Please. Begging will get you nowhere, Noi. He attempts to softly stroke your hair, but you bite his hands, causing him to bleed. Oh, fuck! <sighs> you little. You are so ungrateful. Don't make me teach you a lesson, Noi. I'm trying to be nice, you know. You are making this hard, and you are already starting to annoy me. Well, I'm sorry, man. Perhaps I should demonstrate you who is the charge, who is in charge here. Wait. No, please. What are you gonna do, man? I'm just scared. I'm sorry. Don't do that. I don't even know who you are, or what you want from me. And this is basement is creepy as hell. I'm sorry about this. I haven't had time to make this place more comfortable. But I forgive you for being disobedient this time. See, I am a good person. Uh huh. So why don't you try to be nice to me? I might give you a reward. Oh, okay. Is the reward freedom? Yeah, that's what you want, man. Oh, fortunate. No, maybe one day, but for now, no. Try to act appropriately from now on, okay? It says coming soon. Fine. Okay, I will act appropriately. For now, excellent. Being calm and obedient make you much cuter. Well, that wasn't so difficult, was it? Yeah, it was it, man. A little respect doesn't hurt anyone. For now, I have to play along with this crazy freak. I have no idea what he is capable of. I'm gonna skip it.、Uh, did you say we know each other? Well, you mentioned that we know each other. How? Quite smiling. Quite smiling and respond. We do. Oh, you want to know thing about me, Elodie? Hmm. Yeah, I'm just trying to remember things. Okay. Very well then. I guess it won't hurt any, hurt anyone if ans if I answer your question. He stretch a little and look at you. And looks at you. Back in high school, we were classmates, huh? What? How is this possible? I've never seen him in my life, and I can't remember anyone like him. He is playing with my mind. There is no way. 
It is okay if you don't remember. We didn't actually talk a lot. Just once or twice, perhaps. I was the quiet guy. Maybe you didn't even notice my existence. Okay, but I noticed yours. You're a wonderful creature. Creation, Nori. Okay, I really wanted to be... I really wanted you to be mine. For so many years, I watched you. Wow, that's a lot. What the hell is he talking about? It's been so long, so long since high school. It's impossible that he was obsessed with me for so long. What the hell? Are you kidnap and you kidnapping me? You could just talk to me like a normal person. Yeah, normal person. I am a normal person, no I? No, you aren't normal, man. I just have a special way to show it. You will get used to it in time. I know you are afraid. To be honest, I'll be afraid too. But you will see how much I love you. And one day you will love me too. This guy is so delusional. Yeah, he is so delusional. You will see in time that this is destiny. There were many people who wanted to be with you in high school. I hated them so much. However, I was aware that one day you would be mine. You would be only mine. You are crazy. You are crazy, man. And... Suddenly, his phone buzzes. He looks at the phone and says, Listen, I'm a little busy at the moment. Okay, you're gonna be back in a few hours. I can't skip it, really. Until then, be a good puppy, okay? Are you going to leave me here like this? Yes. Uh, I mean, I still haven't earned earn my tr you haven't earned my trust yet. For a while, you will remain tied. Oh, come on, please. You know. My name is Lino. Okay, that's his name. He approaches you and touches your neck tenderly. Don't touch me. You will. You will wait here like a good puppy, okay? No, okay, man. Good enough. See you later, puppy. At least he is gone now. You take a deep breath and make sure he's gone. This creepy is crazy. I need to get out of here. Despite your best effort to break free from the robe and chair, you collapse on the cold floor with the chair. Ugh. Okay, we can skip this now. Wait for him and make... To make him untie you. Yeah, we, we, we can wait for him. Even as I try to reach those boxes, I can't open them. Yeah, even if you tried. It'll be useless if I try. Instead, I'm going to wait for the pike path to come back. I will be nice and ask him to untie me. And I will be able to escape from this place. He doesn't seem to strong enough to stop me anyway. For now, I suppose I'll try to get back some strength and relax a bit. As you manage to relax a bit, you hear footsteps approaching the door. He's back. Oh, my beautiful boy. My beautiful puppy fell asleep. Oh, where is he? I was just trying to relax and keep myself warm. It's quite cold here. I understand, but why are you on the floor again? I thought you would act appropriately. Like we talk about. I suppose I was wrong. Oh, come on, man. I suppose I was wrong. Grabbing the chair's corner, Lunu turns to you, turns you back to face him, and put the chair in the right position again. It was an accident. Uh, I saw a rat and got a little scared. And I fell. 
Okay then, I believe you for now. I'll believe you. But I clean this place often. I've never seen a rat here. Oh, besides, it's pretty cold from for them here, don't you think? It is, man. Mm, I actually saw one, a big one. Fine, but if you lie to me, you'll regret it. Ah, <sighs> fortunate. Why would I lie to you? I know if I lie, you will hurt me. I don't dare to upset you. Mm, that's so cute. That's what I like to hear. Okay. Hmm. I think besides finding you on the floor, you are quite obedient. You said something about food earlier. I'm pretty hungry, you know. Free food. That may be the only good thing in this situation. Oh, right. I made you a delicious food. How will I, f how will I feed myself? I'm tied. Will you untie me? Yeah, man. Are you gonna going to untie us? Don't worry. I will feed you. Oh, okay. Oh, hell no. What? I think it's better to eat alone. What? Why? I eat... I eat at a special pace. I'm just not used to it. it I would like to eat alone. I'm gonna go with this. I'm really not used to it. I really want to eat alone, please. Yeah. Oh, I know you are not used to this, darling. You live alone. And your ex-partner, well... Let's just say it didn't end well. How the hell did he know? But I don't really care. I want to feed you. You will get used to it. Really? There is no way for us to run away from this guy. You will love it in time. I will show you how much I love you, darling. Anyway, I'm going to get the food now. Stay here quietly. I was here. Yeah, I had to take... Oh, sorry guys, I had to take rest because I had running nose. No, I... Stay here quietly. Stay here quietly. What the hell is wrong with him? I want to eat alone. I hope you I hope you are hungry. I made this especially for you. Oh okay, that's so sweet of you man. I like this. I know it's one of your favorites. How did you know? I told you I was watching you. Okay. Cooking Yes. I also used to follow you to the market, darling. You eat a lot of instant stuff. Not very healthy. Hmm. I must say you need a lovely partner to cook for you. I will be happy to follow this rule for you. Okay, you are being kidnapped. Just tell me what you want. And I will cook for you. You are so quiet. Anyway, eat so I can give you a reward. Say, uh -huh. It's so stupid. I'm not a child. And I don't know this creep. How can he treat me like this? I'm not going to say that. Okay, okay, fine. Just eat, darling. You can't eat alone anyway. Just accept my help. You take a single bite of the meal as he feeds you. It's not bad. It is warm. Is it warm enough, darling? Yeah. And stop calling me that. I took care to put the right space spices. I know you can be a bit picky. Damn. He talks like he knows me. When we barely spoke. When we barely spoke in the past. What are you thinking about? You are quite quiet. Mm, I'll just 
I can't let him know I am making plans to get away. Uh, ah, you are thinking how good the food is, weren't you? Sure. After a while, you finish eating and he put the plate away. Now, it's time for the promised reward. Liu Niu, Liu Niu walks behind you, reaching for a small box. Let's see... Oh, I guess... In... You want me to put it, right? Will you wear it? Okay, this time I'm gonna say yes. Fine. I will wear it. That's what I like to hear. As long as I am not sitting in a stupid in the stupid chair anymore. Yeah, it's not good for us to sit all day. Hmm. But I warn you, if you try to attack me, I will kill you. Oh my god. He did kill us in the previous ending. I thought you loved me. I do. I love you, but I have limits, my dear. Okay, this dude. I don't like being attacked or hit by others. Especially by the person I love. So I won't hesitate to end it right now. Oh, This dude. Okay, let's see. Nunu walks behind you and attaches the collar to your neck. Then locks it. You notice the chain he intends to tie around your hand. He intends to tie around your hand. I might have a chance. You know, slowly untie the rope around your hands. Um, he doesn't like being attacked. So yeah, don't do anything. He. Rem he removes the chair, taking it away, securing your chain around the hand. See? Much better. Plus, you look pretty good with them. Really, man, this is so stupid. I can't believe I'm actually doing this. But I have to be calm. For now. You have a bed behind you. And there is a toilet. In the small room over there. That's why you won't have to go upstairs. Yeah, what about the fridge? I'm gonna save here. What about the fridge, man? What if I am hungry? I need a fridge. I will bring you food anyway. I will cook for you and prepare everything you need. But I want to do it myself. You know, I saw you cooking, right? And how close you came to burn down your kitchen. And how you live with instant noodle. And... Okay, okay, I get it. You don't have to, to mock me. I'm not mocking you, darling. I'm just telling the truth. This guy, I swear. If I, if Karma doesn't kill him, I will. <laughs> okay. And if you eat everything from the plate and behave well, <clears throat> I will have many surprises for you. Like what? What kind of surprises you have, man? You will see. Actually... Tomorrow, I have a surprise for you. I swear, if it's another call or something stupid like this, I'm going to die. I'm just hoping for a normal surprises. May I know what kind of surprise? No. You're killing us with excitement. Why not? Are you stupid? It's called surprise for a reason. Yeah, but... I guess it's normal to ask when I don't know anything about you or what kind of weird surprises you have for me. Relax. It doesn't bite. 
Ugh. Okay, fine. Before I let you sleep, I want to play a game with you. A game? Yep. What if I refuse? You can't refuse. You will play. Or you will sleep tight to the chair again. <gasps> no, man, no, I don't want that. Now, let's get started. It's just a question game. Hmm, okay. How was your high school life? Um, good. I think. You don't help, Noi. Play the game for real and answer seriously. Let's try again. Did you had good grades, Nori? Nope, I didn't. It was bad. One of the devastating, devastating time in my life. Anyway. Um, 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 no. I didn't have the best grades. Hmm, are you sure, Nori? I remember all those teachers prizing you for being such a good, good student. Well, by the end of the year, I was. I mean, by the, by, by the end of the last grade. I see, you still don't remember much. Let's continue. Why is he asking me about high school again? Did you have friends in high school? They weren't really my friend. Uh, shave. Yes. Yes, I had friends. How many? Mm, a few, I think two or three. If you say so, I thought you, you and your seed mate were close. Just regular friends. Anyway, now for the last question. Do you miss seeing your seatmate? Why are you asking this? Answer the question. Not until you tell me why. Tell me why. Alright, Nori. Tomorrow I will bring you a special gift. And I will answer every question you have, darling. For now, try to get some sleep. The bed is new, so don't worry about sleeping on it. Leonin gets up and leaves the room, leaving you alone. At least it's better than sleeping in the chair, on the chair. How should I escape? Not spoke to break metal chain. I can't get close enough to the window. I can't get close enough to the door. I can't cut off my hand or the collar I guess we ended up sleeping then I feel like there is no way out of this everything I do is in vain maybe I should stay here I get free food at least and he knows how to cook besides kidnapping me he didn't do anything but right what what am I thinking I think I'm going crazy. He, he, he kidnapped me. He's a pike rat. Sooner or later, he'll try to hurt me. I just need more time to think about it. And get some sleep. Day two. Good morning. Rise and shine, my dear. You, you scared me, man. You scared her. I know. Good God, you're so cute and you're scared. You really are cute. I should scare you more often. Stop it. Okay, okay. By the way, you need to take, you need to take a shower. You stink. Yeah, because of you, man. And you expect me to like you. Don't take it personally. I'm just being honest. I would never lie to you. And he expect me to believe him. Yeah, no. I'm hungry again. I don't even know what time it is. Can I have a breakfast after? Sure. So here's the deal. I will handcuff you and take you to the bathroom. After you enter the bathroom, I will lock you inside. 
and I will give you the key to remove your handcuffs so you can undress. I will leave the key under the door. After you shower and get dressed, you put back the handcuff and slide the key under the door. And the door has a visor. I want you to show me the handcuffs and the face that they are securely locked. Uh, I think this is my chance too. I know that expression, Nori. Oh, bracket, he knows our expression also. If you try something, I swear I'll keep you in that bathroom forever until you rot, until you rot in there. So be a good puppy and don't piss me off. I won't do anything. Oh, you're a pike bath man. And you're just gonna lock us in the bathroom and let us die there? Like a rat? Really? <sighs> if there is a way or a small window we can escape from. I hope. I also took your house clothes. I put the new ones in the bathroom. Deal? Yeah, fine man, what if I want? You don't want to rot in the bathroom, do you, Nori? <sighs> Just don't do anything stupid. Wait, hold on. How did you get into my house? We don't talk about that. Anyway, he walks over to you and puts on the handcuffs. Then he unties your hand, chain and collar. Okay. I could hit him and run, but I don't have the key yet, and I don't know where the entrance is, or the rooms, and maybe I should stay and do what he wants until I make a good plan. Follow me, finally, out of this room of hell, basement or whatever. I think we are in his room, I guess. How beautiful it is. I like the art in this game. A hallway. Why does it look like this hallway went to... World War. World, World War. <laughs> we don't know, man. Hey, don't be rude. I didn't have the time to fix the basement when I moved here. You know, I bought this house specially. Okay, in the middle of nowhere. Yes, don't worry, we will decorate together. In the future, when you finally accept me as your partner. So, never. How delusional is he? I will never love him. I'm glad you got used to us already. You know, at first I thought it would take yours. Years, maybe 20, 30 or something. You know, I don't want to hurt you. I just want you to give me a chance. I never want, I never meant to hurt you. But here we are, trapped underneath your power. Yes, I might be complicated. I might be delusional and a little crazy. But I do all of this for you, for us. I really love you, Nori. And if I choose to show up in your life and ask for a chance, I know you wouldn't give it to me. So I had to make the decision to make you give me a chance, whether you like it or not. I wish things had been different. Let's take you to the bathroom now. After you go upstairs, Nunu opens the white door and lets you in. This dude. Oh. This is not like the rest of the basement. This room looks really clean and nice. Yeah, well, I had time to renovate the bathroom and make it comfortable. In order to prevent you from escaping, I just had to remove the windows and repair the holes. Really? And here I am wishing there will be an, a small window just for me to escape. That was the hard part. The rest was easy. Hold on. Did you do this on your own? 
Didn't you hire a builder or? No, I didn't myself. Okay, he's a builder, but a bike was back up as one. I don't want suspicious people asking about this place. This guy is smarter than I thought. To be honest, there would be some suspicious thoughts if a guy bought a house in the middle of nowhere, removing the windows. This just shows me how hard it will be to find a way out of this hell hole. Anyway, I'm going to lock you in here now. I'll be outside the door if you need anything. When you are done, slide the key back under the door and handcuff yourself. He leaves you alone in the bathroom. Not that long after, he slides the key under the door. He actually did it. I wonder if I can take one of the keys. Maybe he won't notice. He will notice, girl. No, I'm not be I'm not fooling this guy. At least I can take a shower now. Look around. I think I will look around a bit. Let's see. Maybe I'll look in the closet. You open the closet, but you only find towels. Hmm, hold on. What's oh, this? A keychain. Why does it look familiar? Is it mine? I wouldn't really buy something like this. Should I keep it? Maybe he won't notice if I have it in my pocket. Whatever, I'll keep it. I should take a shower now. A, r a really small bath. A really s After taking off your clothes, you finally get to the shower. Uh, finally. I felt like I haven't showered in years. I just need to relax a bit and wash up. After a while, you get out of the shower and put on your new clean clothes. I should put my handcuffs back now. But I don't want... I want to be free. I want to go home. I'm sick of this place. I didn't find anything useful in this bathroom. Suddenly, there's a knock in the door. Are you done? An hour has already passed. Of course, it's him. Who else? Okay, let's do this. You put the handcuffs back in your hands and lock them back. Yes, I'm done. Let let me out. Show me the handcuff on the visor. Oh, yes, I remember. Here. You show him your handcuff hands on the visor and after a few seconds, he opens the door. Ah, uh, I'm not... I'm not going to lie. I didn't expect you to be so obedient. I don't want to root here. To root here. Fair enough. Yeah, well, I'm not planning to be rooting here in the bathroom. Wait a second. Why? The visor. In the door. You didn't look while I was taking a shower, did you? What kind of provide do you think I am? I would never do such a thing. I respect you too much, Nori. At least he is not a creepy pervert. <laughs> okay, just a pico. Okay, thanks. Okay, thanks. Let's take you back to the basement. He is taking us back to the basement. You smell so much better. Yeah, I know. You have no idea how much I want to hug you right now. I all deem that we are together. Hmm, okay. Hugging each other. Good for him. It's good to have dreams. Yeah, mm, I'm hungry. Yeah. I kept my promise, don't worry. Let me put your collar and chain back and I will give you the food. I hate this. Yeah, I don't like it. Okay, wait there. He told me to have... He had a surprise for me today. Maybe it's just the food. Whatever. I don't care. I'm just hungry. 
After a while, he came back and put the food on the table. <gasps> How lovely. Okay. It doesn't look bad. Looks better than my in instant noodle. You start eating, but you can't help but feel weird as he stares at you. Can you stop looking at me? It's weird being watched while I'm eating. I'm sorry. You are so cute when you eat. I remember at school when you had lunch. You were so cute back then. Rick. Yeah, stop it. Ah, oh, is my puppy shy? You will get used to it. Should I get used to you looking at me like while I'll eat? Get used to being in my company. Maybe I should start a conversation so he doesn't look at me like the freak he is. You said you had a surprise for me. If it's the food, thank you. It's very good. It's not the food. It's not the food. Oh, you want to get your gift so bad. Let's hope it's not one of his stupid colors. When can I get it? Later. Hmm. Why do I feel this is bad? I just hope you don't bring my friend in pieces to me. Maybe it belongs to you. I wanted to return it to you. Oh, you found it. What do you mean? I put it in there for you. Huh? What? Why? I know you, Nori. I know you'd be looking for things inside the bathroom. You are quite a re a re Okay. I, we are being rebellious, but uh, in a good way, just for you not to piss off on us. I read somewhere that some objects, small smells or sights can activate lost memories. Hmm. I thought if I put something like this in the bathroom for you to find, you would remember. Remember what? You pass, your pass, your high school life. I didn't. I see. Do you want me to tell you? I guess. It was... Valentine's Day in high school. You have lots you have lots of messages and chocolates, both from boys and girls. So I thought Hey Nori Oh this was him. Oh hi I am um, I wanted to give you something Oh that's look cute Oh, so this was from him. But why are you giving me this? Um, I just... Hey, no, stop talking with the weirdo and come see this. Sorry, I have to go. Here, you can have it back. But... Okay. Oh, that was him. Do you remember now? Yeah. I'm sorry. I didn't know you were trying to... It's okay. I'm glad you remember now. Okay. Now that you, you've you eaten and remembered a bit about the past, I'm going to put the dishes in the wash and go after your surprise. I think you're going to get a little bored here. I'm going to give you a coloring book for being good today. I'm not a kid, but I guess it's better than doing basically nothing. Okay, stay here. Uh, after a while, he comes back to you with a coloring book. Okay, good thing this was a, a simple surprise. There you go. But why didn't you get the surprise earlier? earlier? Because it's complicated. So, be a good puppy and wait for me. Hmm. I will miss... Okay, this wasn't the surprise then. I'll miss you. Alone with my thoughts again. I wonder what the surprise is. 
may be a cake. And that's why he couldn't get it sooner. Hmm. Whatever. I should go to bed. Okay, this is the basement. Uh, the basement doesn't look good at all. However, those walls are terrifying. If I were him, I'd probably make the basement nicer and then do the rest of the house. Because the person I like lives in the basement. Anyway, lie in bed and do nothing. Color the book. Uh, you take the coloring book and look at the pages. Hold up. How am I supposed to color this? I don't have pencils. Should I color this with my tears and blood? Yeah, no, thank you. You throw the book away. Hold on. Maybe I should check the boxes and stuff around. Maybe I'll find something useful. I'm not tied to the chair anymore. Hmm. Anything can be useful here. Yeah, we need to look around. After researching through some empty and useless boxes, you finally found a very, very heavy box. The frick is this? <gasps> oh, shh. There are many things. I must find the useful items. There's a lot of things. Will he been using the cameras to watch us? I must find the useful items. The useful items. Is this what you mean? Um, a clip. I think I can open the chain locks with this. I have to hide it, but where? Hmm, I think I'll keep it in the vent. He will never look there. Anyway, there is nothing useful other than the clip in this box. Oh, okay. After hiding, hiding the clip in the vent, you sit down in bed. Okay, I have a clip now. I can unlock myself when I want now. I just need to... Perfect moment when he's not here. He will be back soon, so it's not good time to escape right now. The camera and other stuff in the boxes were broken in a way. Now, it's time to relax. Okay, it's time for us to relax then. Huh. Hey, Nori. Uh, I'm back. Well, why there is blood on you, man? Why do you look so scared? What? Why? Why are you full of blood? I want to get your surprise. You went to get... What did you do? Okay, listen to me. Be calm. So, you know, in the past, in high school, someone was spreading rumors about you? And you were really hurt? Oh, don't tell me you killed them. I hate it when someone hurts you. I despise them. Anyway, so I had time to research the past events. And the trash who did this to you was your stupid seatmate. What the fuck? So I took the care of him. So I took care of him for you. Me, you, Nori. I know you are upset, angry, shocked, but I did it for you. For months, I saw you crying in the schoolyard every day when no one else was around. I promised myself that I would kill the person who hurt you. You deserve better. You deserve to be happy. And that person took away your happiness. That, but that was in high school, man. We are grown up now. I deserve someone better than you, man. So I also took something from him in return. His life. You are crazy. Get away from me. How could you do that? You, you are crazy. I did it for you. And that person deserved it. 
No, he didn't. He didn't deserve to die. He ru ruined your high school years. All of them were insulting you. Everyone hated you. Everyone was gossiping about you. You start to skip high school every day for some months. I, I couldn't let it slide like that. Him being happy and well while he ruined your life. Hurting someone is never an option. There are there is karma to take care of them. And you are not karma. You are a crazy psychopath. And I hate you. Oh. oh, fine. Good night. He slams the door and locks it. How could he do this? Even call this a surprise? He didn't have to take revenge on something, something that happened a few years ago. What the hell is wrong with him? I, I think I'm going to puke. After feeling a little bitter, you go to bed exhausted. I really hate him. I just hope we don't do anything bad. We are on day three now. He used, he usually comes here at this time of day. I guess he's still mad. Yeah, it's morning. Maybe I won't have breakfast this morning. Or maybe he just, he just left. I mean, I can unlock my handcuff whenever I want. In fact, it would be better if he disappeared. Maybe I should... Uh oh. Oh, you're already awake. So, are you still mad at me? What do you think? Yes. At least you're smart. You know, he hurt you, right? Not physically. You got bullied. He didn't hurt you directly. But he did. And he wasn't Mr. Perfect. He cheated on he cheated on his girlfriend. And then he also cheated on his second girlfriend with the third one. Hmm. And also he cyber police people. And he enough. You shouldn't have killed him. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. You are not sorry. Not entirely, but I am. So, um, I wanted to talk to you about something. Ah, uh, this dude. <sighs> what do you want to hear? Well, what, what if I win with this? I don't want to hear anything from you. Please. I know what I did was wrong. Very, very, very wrong. I won't do it again. You wanted to do it again. I mean, if I had to. Really, man. Okay, okay. I'm joking. I will be good. I promise. He's not. He's not very convenient. He's not very convincing. But I will believe him for now. So can I talk with you? Very well. Speak. So. I thought about it. And maybe it's better. To forget about what happened. So you just want me to. Please listen to me. I will be good, I promise, and you know he deserve it, deep down, so please let's forget about it. I, I have another gift for you, no, I don't want your gifts anymore. Darling, this is a good gift, mm, yeah sure, another dead friend, no. If you promise to forget this event, I will tell you about the gift. It's a nice gift. So, alright. That's what I like to hear. Good. 
to see that I really try to make this work, I would like to take you to the garden. Oh. Are you serious? Will you take me out with you? Yes. Hmm. You are not kidding, right? Why would I joke with you after I made you? I made you mad. I don't have the, a death wish. Okay, that's nice, nice of you. Okay, I forgave you. For now. So, when can we go? I was thinking about tonight, but we can go there earlier if you want. Yes, please. I need fresh air. I really want to see you happy, Nori. You will wear your handcuff, okay? Of course. And you will wear a blindfold until we get out. I don't want you to see the way to the exit door. Uh, deal. I'm going to get the blindfold. And now we can go to the garden. And we can go to the garden. Okay, okay, fine. Let's go, man. Whatever you want. I can't believe he's actually taking me out. And it's only been a few days since I've been here. Something is strange. I mean, release your hell hostage in the garden. Something is weird. Or maybe... Ready to go? Yes. Perfect. Stay still. He blindfolded and handcuffed you. Okay. Do you want me to hold your hands and lead you out to your... Or do you prefer that I tell you which way to go? Um... Mm. I'm gonna go... Yes, hold my hand, man. Hold my hand. Yay! Okay, he's exciting. He held your hand and gently led you upstairs. Are you ready? Yes. Wow! Okay, I, I, I love these kind of gardens. It's... Beautiful. Yes. It's been a while since they grow up like this. Did you plant them? Only the white ones. The pink ones were already here when I moved in. They are gorgeous. I've never seen a place like this. Because you don't go out much. But I promise we will travel a lot together when you become my partner. Hmm. You know, I don't want to hold you hostage forever. I want to have a normal relationship even if we start off on the wrong foot. I don't want to keep you like a bird in a cage. Freedom is important. I would hate to be forced to stay somewhere. Especially in an old basement. Yeah, sorry. I can't believe you got me out of there. It's only been a few days. I wanted to show you that I don't see you as my hostage, but as my future lover. Hmm. So, so, I want to take a step and, uh, will you please give me another chance to show you that I am a good person and show you that I love and respect you and that we can be happy forever together. Please, trust me and I will trust you. Uh, you don't have to answer me right away. Take your time. By the way, I was thinking of having breakfast in the garden today. We had a table with a chair there. We have a table and chair there. And the weather is perfect. Sure. I was sure you'd say that. Have I already set the plates? See, I already know my lover very well. I'm not your... yet. Follow me. Oh, okay, he is sitting nice stuff, but he's a pacifier. Still, I haven't eaten pancakes in a long time. Those really look fluffy, soft, and warm. You take a piece of pancake with a syrup. They, uh, this taste. The pancake has a subtle sweetness, fluffy and tender, with soft note of vanilla 
or milk that gives it a rich welcome aroma, welcoming aroma. And the syrup is so sweet and tasty, balancing the softness. Do you like it? I love it. I didn't eat pancakes like this in mm, years. I will always cook you delicious food. Whatever you want me to cook, I will cook. That doesn't sound bad. I can't cook more than instant ramen, and he cooks very well. Okay, since you are starting to like the guy. Wow, it was a comfortable morning. I agree. Hi, um, thank you. I haven't had anything like this in a while. I think I will give you a real chance this time. Okay, he's happy. Really? Really, you made me the happiest person alive, Noe. I promise you won't regret your decision. Okay. I think we should go back. Can't we stay a little longer? I really miss the fresh air. I promise we'll go out more often. Now that you've given me a chance, things will change. In a good way. I really hope so. Crossway. I promise. I will untie you. And we can move into our room together soon. I just need some time to make sure you really like me. And you can move freely in the house. No handcuffs. Really? Yes, you are not my prisoner. You are my... You are the love of my life, Nori. Sounds good. Let's go back now, shall we? Okay. But first, I need to blindfold you again. Just to be sure. Sounds like a trust issues to me. Okay. Can you see anything? Nope. Then let's go back. I really wish I could stay outside more. Yeah, I wish you could also stay outside more. I miss being outside. But unfortunately, this bike was controlling us. Back inside. So I was thinking. Maybe I should just leave only the chain collar around your neck. And get rid of the handcuffs from your hands. Wait, really? Yes, to show you that I'm starting to trust you. And the chain is longer, so you can move more around the basement. Stretch your legs a little, you know. Damn, he really trying to show me he trusts me. Thanks. I'm going to the town to buy some groceries. I will be there for a while. Do you want me to buy you something from the store? Chips! So the chips, both of them are my favorites. It's not very healthy, you know that. Ah, oh, come on, so I'm not allowed to eat or drink my favorite snacks or drinks? Okay, I guess I will add it to the list for you, honey. As you should. So, how long will it take? I don't know, a few hours? Why? Will you miss me, my darling? Uh, just kidding, relax. Okay, I have to go. Don't try anything funny, okay? I'm serious. This is going very well. I don't think you want to destroy all of that, or do you? No, of course not. That's good. Take care, darling. Linu opened the door and then locked it. His footstep could be heard going upstairs. Frick you, man. I'm gonna escape. I still have to get out of this place. I don't know how much longer I can do this. You waited half an hour or more to take sure to make sure he's gone. Alright. I'm still stuck in this collar, but at least I can move around more. I have to get to the door. No way. Ewa, you have got to be kidding me. He had he put numbers there. A password. How the hell am I supposed to know the password? Oh, think, Nori, think. Think. Good, I have the clip. 
Maybe I can unlock the door with the clip. You take the clip from the vent and try to unlock the door. Stupid. It's so stupid. How can I escape if I can't open the door? Wait, I might know the password. I might know the password. I think I might know the password. I have to try. Maybe I saw the code somewhere. To, to proceed, you need to enter the correct three digit code number only. Enter three numbers. Wait, did you saw numbers anywhere? Frank, I missed that. One, two, three. The code isn't correct. Try again. Twelve seconds later. So the car is gonna oh, frick. Give up. I don't remember seeing numbers. Unfortunate. Yeah, I really don't know the password. I think I'll just I'm gonna save here. Two four or five. Accept this for now. I think I'll just wait and accept this for now. I wish I know that stupid password. I think I can do something else for now. I should have reminded him to give me some crayons. I'm starting to get bored. I wonder how long it will take him to untie me. Days? Days? Months? Years? I should think of something else. Not this. Make origami. Read the book. Ah, huh, let's make origami. I might be able to rip some of the papers out of that coloring book and try to create, to create the origami shuriken I once saw in a tutorial. The coloring book is for me. So he won't mind if I tear some pages. I think I will take a page. I don't like mm, page with flowers, page with panda, page with the landscape. Wait, it's just one page. Well, it's just one page. And I don't like it that much anyway. And it's not like I can draw it. Well, let's see. You sit down and try to make the origami. How can I do this without scissoring and glue? I hate origami. Why did I want to do this? Well, we just wanted to, sp to spend to waste some time until he come back. After some time, you manage to do something. Wait. Three, two, three, one. Two, three, one. Five, four, forty. Two, three, one, five, four. Okay. At least it's shaped like a shuriken. I should have paid more attention to that tutorial in the past. I am back, darling. Did you miss me? More or less. What is that? Origami. Did you? Tear out one of the pages from the coloring book. Look, it was ugly. It was an ugly one. And someone didn't give me anything to color the pages. I'm, I'm very sorry. I completely forgot to give you the pencils. Please forgive me. It's okay. Your origami thing looks really good. It's not a thing. It's a shuriken. Oh, I see. My bad. He did say he hated being. What if I did that? Is he gonna kill us? I have to try. You take the shuriken and throw it at Luno. Hey! What was that for? For kidnapping me and keeping me in the basement with a coloring book and zero pencil to color it. Oh. I thought you were getting used to this place. Not really. I understand. It might be a little hot at first. 
but here you will be treated well. Even when you are angry, I try my best not to be mean when I'm angry. Here, you can have it back. Do you know? Do you know you have good origami skill? Origami skill. If you ignore the broken parts, shorts. If you ignore the broken parts, just ignore this. Two, three, one, five. Four, okay. Pfft. You did amazing, darling. Anyway, here, it's your request, your majesty. Oh, chips. I brought the chips you wanted. And it's new, it's a new flavor. Thank you. It's still unhealthy, but enjoy. I won't even eat all that. Then, how about you eat them at the movie tonight? Huh? What movie? I was thinking maybe um, maybe you want to watch a movie with me tonight? I think we should do activities like this, you know? Getting to know each other better and to spend more time outside the basement. Getting out of this basement sounds like a good idea. Maybe I should accept I haven't seen a movie in a while, so... Fine, fine. Really? You made me the happiest person alive, my darling. I love you so much. Whatever. Still not a fan of love, hmm. I'm going to prepare some delicious popcorns. And some more soda. Alright. Alright, you stay here and relax, Nori. It shouldn't take long. Well, I wear. Well, will I wear handcuffs? Yes. Yeah. Okay. At least I get snacks and movie tonight. This dude. After a while, a few minutes, he finally returns. Are you ready to go up, honey? Yeah. I have to handcuff you. Stay still. There you go. It's not too tight, is it? Is it com comfortable? Yes. Alright, let's go. Wow. Okay, that, that looks comfortable. It's just the room I like to watch movies in. It looks amazing. I'm glad you like it. So for tonight, we are going to watch a horror movie. I live in one. Don't be mean. I'm not keeping you in the ab in abandoned in an abandoned hospital. Just kidding. Relax. Oh. Okay. I guess. So, is it a horror movie? Yes. I love the horror ones. Okay, why don't you turn off the lights and we can get start. Turn off the lights? Yes. No. Why? I thought you liked horror movies. Yes, but not with the lights off. I can't see in the dark. Oh, and it's more horror? No. Whatever. So what's, what movie are we watching? Welcome to the... Welcome to Weisenberg. 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 Okay. It's a new movie about criminal who hunt the citizens of a city every night. Everyone who leaves the house after 11 p.m. are... What? Condemned? Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Sounds fun. I know that you have a very... Specific taste in movies, but I don't think this one will disappoint you. So you say you love me, right? More than anything. Then let's watch this with the lights off. Do you really want to watch with the lights off? Yes. Why? Because the movie is scarier in the dark. Oh, okay. 
Can we turn on the lights for a while? No. Just a little. You know, don't be coward. Gasp. You said my name. Shh. That's it. It's starting. Um. He has a knife. Everyone has knives. We find them in the kitchen. Stop mocking me. He's gay. What if I mock him? He is very scary. Damn. Those demonic red eyes. I bet this movie is real. You think so? For sure. I bet everyone who looks at this movie will be haunted by him. No, no. Yes. And he will be under the bed and... Shut up! He is not real. He is. Shush. Here comes the interesting part. <laughs> He's so scared. How can he be afraid he, he himself is a kidnapper? I should be the one who, who is afraid. Yeah, we should be the one who is afraid. Is he is he shaking? Hey, are you okay? Yes, but the, look how he attacks them. It's it's so scary. So much blood. What if I mock him even more? Damn, imagine what it would be like if he was in our house. D don't say that. <laughs> I mean, he's a pod tip. <laughs> this house is in the middle of nowhere. It would be a jackpot for him. I can imagine him. I can imagine him knocking on the door. No, stop it. Nobody comes here. It, it, it's just us. L let's just watch. <laughs> what? Is he? God, you scared me. What the hell? This is a sorry, no? I, 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 those bodies. Please, let's turn on the lights. The movie is almost over. You can hold on a little longer. I will try. See? It's already over. The movie said based on a short on a true story. He is real. It just to make the story more creepy. I've never heard heard of a Wisenberg murder. So relax. And the movie is old. The killer is probably dead or grandfather. Nori. Okay, okay, can we sleep together tonight? <laughs> oh, really? Please. It's it's scary to sleep alone. I promise I won't do anything weird. Just just share the bed. The, the bed in the basement is already small. I don't know. Not the one in the basement. The normal one. Huh? Okay. Really? Thank you very much. I swear I'm not usually a coward. I'm going to clean up a little in here. And we are going to bed. Is it okay for you? Make sure the Wiesenberg color doesn't catch you. <laughs> not funny. Do you want me to stay with you or not? Uh, yes. Alright. He starts uh, cleaning the tables and taking away the empty popcorns and soda cans. The movie was fun. Especially since he was so scared. <laughs> maybe it won't be bad here. I think maybe I'd really like to stay here. And I am brain free. Okay, let's sleep, shall we? Yep. Um, by the way. I still don't feel comfortable wearing pajamas with other people. So, so I'll sleep like this. I guess that's okay. Go to the bedroom. Oh, it's, it's a nice bedroom. Here we are. Now the Wiesenberg killer won't attack us. 
because there are two of us. He called the couple, though. Shush! Enough with the movie killer. We need to sleep. I don't like late nights. Easy to say you have a watch. I don't even have a clock in that basement to keep track of the time. <laughs> I'll, I'll put a clock in your basement, happy? A, lit a little, yes. God, good. Then don't try anything while I sleep. I wake up easily. And I don't think you want me to make you sit in the basement for months without going to the garden. Okay, you are being scared now. It is a threat. Not really. More of a warning. I can't believe we are actually going to sleep together. For the first time. Good night, my dear. I hope you have you had fun hanging out together. And the movie Hmm, good night. Nunu turns to his side of the bed and closes his eyes. What a day. It was fun and interesting and he didn't do any harm yet. He and he didn't do me any harm yet. Other than that I enjoyed the movie. And he keeps his quote. I slowly going I slowly gain his trust and he slowly gives me freedoms. Why can't I fall asleep? You look at Luno and see him sleeping peacefully. What if I escape? Bye bye man. He is asleep. I think I have the clip with me. It was okay with him. But no person should be locked in a cage. I need my freedom. You slowly get out of bed, making sure he doesn't wake up, and slowly walks toward the door. You reach the door and open it slowly, then close it behind you extremely quietly. Now it's time to get right of this. Unlock the handcuff. You look around. Searching for the front door. He has a really nice house. I can't turn on the light. It's not safe. What can I do? I need to find the front door. But it's probably locked. I need to find the key. Maybe it's in his jacket. I have to go back. Right. Why is it so hard? Maybe I should have checked the windows. Maybe they are unlocked. Find the keys. What if I find the keys? There is no point. I'm sure he made sure that they were locked anyway. Better not waste time and go get the keys from his jacket. Quietly approach the door and hold it open just in case. The jacket. If it's not there, I will give up. I swear. If he wakes up, I'm dead. I could hit him. And run, but I'm not like that. I don't hurt people, even though they hurt me and they deserve it. I'm not like him. Yeah, we are not like him, we are good people. You slowly approach him and look at his jacket. Okay, he's sleeping like a baby. It's so scary and dangerous. Look at the right pocket. There is nothing here. Look at the left pocket. Please. Please. Be my lucky pocket ticket. <gasps> there you go. Heck yes. You slowly start walking away and slowly as possible. Suddenly the key clips slips from your hand to the floor. Oh. Mother. Oh my god. Uh oh. What are you doing, Nori? Uh oh. We are dead. Where are you? Where are your handcuffs? Why do you have my key? Why? I tried so hard for you, Noi. I even gave you the freedom you didn't deserve. I was so good to you. I. Why? You know, you can't keep me locked up here. I don't want to keep you here. After we became a couple, a real one, I 
I'd let you go anywhere you want. Be happy together. You said you would give me a chance. You lied. You're a liar. Okay, why can't you love me? You know, you can't force someone to love you. I... What? I didn't mean to force you. I wanted to make it happen. To fall in love. All I wanted was you. This is not healthy. This is not healthy, man. What did... What you did is wrong. You have to let me go, you know. My God. You know. You know. His expression changed, guys. What can I do? What should I do? I can't do anything. This is not a 3D game. This is because this is a 2D. It's run by... Uh-oh. Uh. He's really quiet. Let you go. Uh-uh. <laughs> Uh-oh. That's a good joke. I will never let you go. You are the love of my life. We are meant to be together. I can't let you go. We are going to be together forever. Whether you like it or not. I will never stop fighting for my freedom. I will find a way to get out of here. And one day I will succeed. And you will be alone forever. You deserve no one. You deserve to be locked away from every human being. Uh oh. We are getting. We are getting to a bad point here. That's what you think about me. Hmm. You are finally showing your true color. You are so dark, Nori. You are rooting. Rooting inside. B but. You know what? But even if you keep haunting me like this, I still love you. You will never stop loving you. Stop loving you. The most painful thing in the in the world is when your partner hates you. But it's okay. You, you just need more time. As you try to get away, he catches you and throws you to the floor. Sis, where do you think you are going? I want you, my love. Uh-oh, I want you. That I won't be good if you break my trust. And you broke my trust. Go, go on. Tell me. I'd rather be dead than alive with you. So you'd rather be dead than with me. I see. No. I won't kill you. But I will hurt you enough that you can't escape. Forever. What What are you? <laughs> you can feel the skin torn by his knife in your shoulder. <laughs> Stop it. Trust me, Nori. It hurts me more than it hurts you. Seeing you in pain. My soul ashes, I swear. But it's for the best. This is why... You won't escape, darling. He grabs you and pulls you back to the basement, throwing you to the floor. Uh-oh. What now? You won't be able to walk for a while. Your knees and arms will go on vacation. But don't worry, darling. I will take care of you. I can't. What? Because I love you, sweet dreams, my darling. The end, bad end. <laughs> How many endings there for this game? Five ending. There's five ending, guys. What about if I try the windows? I should check them for now. It may be a waste of time, but I better not to complicate my escapes. Check window one. Then this is locked. Let's try again. No. We quite approach the door and hold it open, just in case. The jacket. 
Okay, get back, get back. Let's try again. Check window 2. It's locked. Try again. Yes. Third window. Okay, every window is locked. No. Go on, hold it open just in case. The jacket. If it's not there, I'll give up, I swear. I'm dead. I could hit him and run, but I'm not like that. I don't hurt people, even though they hurt me, and they deserve it. I'm not like him. You slowly approach him and looks, and look at his jacket. Oh, it is so scary. Danger. There are nothing there. Yeah, history. I'm gonna load. Let's skip it. Read the book. I'm gonna read. I think I saw a book or something in a box. It's better than nothing at all. That coloring book is useless in a way. You went to one of the boxes and took out the book. Hmm. It's not a book. It's a manga. Okay. Well, the light can't reach you. Yeah, better than nothing. You start reading the manga, letting the time pass. The story is so damn sad. I feel so sorry for the main character. She deserves better. Like me, I deserve better. Feed him. <laughs> yeah, I know. We came back from the store and find out my little puppy turning into a bookworm. I had no other choices. So you are decided you've decided to look into my personal boxes. You may need to learn what privacy is. You keep me locked down here and expect me not to look around? Fair enough. Besides that, you didn't give me anything to call the pages. Oh, sorry, I completely forgot. Yes, don't blame me for trying to find things to do. I can't just sit around and stare at the ceiling. Alright, alright. So what are you reading? Uh, I found a manga named Where the Lights Can't Reach You. Oh, my favorite. Did you read it? Yep. Anyway, here's your request, your majesty. Oh yeah, we wanted some chips. Let's load. Soon after. No, I'm just, I wanna load. Loading. They weren't really my friends. Oh. Let's continue. Oh, this is when he was... Just have a game, question game. Uh, how was your high school in life? Mm, good, I think. You don't help, Nori. Play the game for real and answer seriously. Let's try it again. Did you have good grades, Nori? Uh, yes. I think I had pretty good grades. Oh, really? I see you remember quite a few things from the past. That's good. Let's continue. Why is he asking me about high school again? Did you have friends in high school? Hmm. They weren't really my friends. Yeah. I mean, I've talked to quite few people, but I don't consider them my friends. More like classmates, people I know. Even your seatmate, seatmate, you two were quite close. He was just my seatmate. Whatever you say, Noi. Anyway, now for the last question. Do you miss seeing your seatmate? Why are you asking this? Answer the question. Not until you tell me why. Alright, Nori. Tomorrow I will bring you. Now let's skip it. 
Mm. Look around. I think we'll look around a bit. Let's see. Close it. Look for a way out. There must be a flue in this bathroom somewhere. It's impossible to have done everything by yourself and not... I'm not making any mistake. You look around, move the closet a little, touch the walls and look for the ceiling. Nothing, of course. Unfortunate. You want to move the cabinet back, but something falls out behind the cabinet. What is this? Eh, it's looked like a school class. Is this my class? From the high school? Why would he put a picture... Of our class behind the cabinet. This is getting weird. I'll keep it. Maybe it will be it will be useful. Now I really should take a shower after taking us. Okay, let's skip this. So I found something. Oh really? What did you find? I was getting ready to take shower and I found this. Yeah, so f so you found it. What? What do you mean? I put that in there for you. I know you'd be looking for things inside the bathroom. You are quite a rebel. Okay, we are rebellious. But in a good way. Uh, I read somewhere that some objects, smells, or sights can activate lost memories. I thought if I put something like this in the bathroom for you to find, you would remember. Remember what? Take a look at this picture. It's is it my class? Yes. Do you remember what day was it? No. What day it was? No worry. Yes. Today is project day. Right. Hey Nori. Sir Maybe this is number. Oh, hi. Mm, I was wondering. Um, don't have a project partner yet. I don't have a project partner. And I thought maybe, maybe you want to, um, hey, Nori, stop talking with that weirdo and come join us. Hey, I'm sorry. I'll talk with you later. Okay. Oh, no wonder. Oh. I'm sorry, I didn't know. Yeah, it's fine. I'm glad you remember now. I'm sorry, I just left you there. I took a photo of class. Maybe, just maybe, it will make you remember the past. Our meeting. Our meetings. I remember now. Yeah. Okay. Now that you've eaten, remember a bit about the past. And I'm going to put the dishes on the dashboard and go after the surprise. I guess you will get a little bit bored in here. I'll give you a coloring book because you were good today. I can't skip. I'm not a kid. But I guess it's better than doing basically nothing. Okay, stay, stay here. Lie on bed and do nothing. Yeah, I'm going to stay in bed for a while. I'm too old to color. Stupid book. While I'm lying in bed... You stare at the ceiling. There is a ventilation system. But it's too small. I would never fit in there. Perhaps if I find a rat or train and train and feed him, I can get him to help me. <laughs> okay. What the hell am I thinking about? Damn. I'm going crazy. Hold up. Maybe I should check the boxes and stuff around. Maybe I found something useful. I'm not tied to a chair anymore. Hmm. Now let's skip it. Oh, this. No, okay. Uh oh. Shouldn't have killed him. He didn't deserve to die, man. What you did wrong. So what he did to you was okay? He didn't tell me, he did he? 
he hurt you. You think I didn't read your notes? How did you start hating every day of your life? He ruined your high school years. All of them were insulting you. Everyone hated you. Everyone was gasping about you. You start to skip high school every day for some months. I, I couldn't let it slide like that. Hmm, him being happy and well while he ruined your life. Hurting someone is never an option, man. He wasn't the good guy you thought he was. I don't care. He didn't deserve to die. I'll leave you alone. Good night, Nori. He slammed the door and locks it. Okay, he's mad. I understand that he was trying to protect me, but killing someone is not the option. He's more psychotic than I thought. Okay, you can skip it now. Okay, let's go. It's fine. Wait, are you serious? Yeah, go on. I, I thought you will be angry and I won't let you talk. Well, I thought about this option. But I guess you deserve a chance to speak. Really? Yeah. So, I thought about it. Uh, maybe better to forget about... Uh, okay, we can skip this part. Hold my hand. Just tell me the direction. What if I told him, tell me the direction? Just tell me the direction. <laughs> sure. Not a fan of holding hands. Hmm. He opens the door. Go left a bit and then... <sighs> Go left a bit and then forward. This is a way for us to escape. Go left a bit and then forward. You follow his instruction and hit yourself into the wall. <laughs> You sat a bit in the left and then forward. I met a little more the, to the left. Just take me upstairs. After a while, you manage to get out. You ready, Nori? Oh, okay. This is where the garden is. Can you undie me? So, I promise you... That I would give you a chance. And I will trust you. Can you untie me? I really wish I could. I trust you. But I don't want to risk losing you. You might change your mind sooner or later. I don't take this a risk. But after I'm... I'm sure you actually like me. I will untie you. I promise. And you will move upstairs. In our room. It doesn't sound bad. Good. Let's go back now. Okay. But first I need to blindfold you again. Okay. Okay. I really want some soda man. It's not very healthy. You know that. So I'm not allowed to eat or drink my favorite snackers. Then. Okay. Okay. Let's skip it. I'm gonna skip. I might know the password. 001. The code is correct. Nice. I can't believe it works. Did he really not think I was smart enough for this? Or maybe he is, he, he is testing me. No, I have to stop overthinking. I have the door open. I have to get rid of this collar now. After some struggle and anger. You finally managed to open the door. To open the eye. I can't believe. I did it. I have to hurry out of this hell hole. Oh, I remember. He took me upstairs when I entered the garden. The right door is the bathroom. So the good one must be the left one. You go upstairs slowly and listen to the door making sure he's not there. I have to hurry up. 
and suddenly I don't feel like leaving. It really looks, yeah, I know it looks really good. Maybe I should go back and. What the hell am I thinking? I have to get out of here. The place is beautiful, but the one who lives here is crazy and delusional. Um, which way should I go? Okay, left door. It's locked. Motherfucker! Right, what about the right door? Please don't be a torture chamber or a random collection room of knives. Eh, uh, this is the kitchen. Okay, I get it. His house is cool. <laughs> but where is the exit? I swear I'm going to jump out of the window. To jump out of the window. Maybe that's not such a bad idea. And the exit door is probably locked. Everyone locks their room before going somewhere especially if they have a kidnapping a kidnapped person in the basement all right let's see i need something to break the windows with take the microwave take the pan i guess the microwave well that will break the window for sure you unplug and take the heavy microwave okay now it's time to break out of this prison you take a deep breath and throw away the microwave that breaks the glass. It was so easy. Too easy. Anyway, I don't want to think twice about it. I'm here again. To be honest, it was very nice. The breakfast in the garden. I almost wanted to stay. I wonder what would have happened if I stayed. What am I thinking? Is this my chance? And besides, the fact that I broke his, sh his windows, he's going to be very upset. I'd rather walk 10 kilometers than have him break my legs for trying to escape. Or break my neck. Leave. Yeah, leave. Are we free now? I was expecting a bigger fence. Maybe even an electric one. Not this. I shouldn't complain. You look around, making sure Lunu won't appear out of nowhere. I can't believe I actually did it. Goodbye, freak. You open the door and close it behind you. Then start running as fast as you can. I've been walking for a few hours already. It's getting dark. I'm hungry and thirsty. But I can't stop. If he finds me, I'll be dead. I have to keep going running. Just a little longer. Just a little longer. End. But you escaped. Or not. The end. Thanks for playing. Really? Okay. Let's load. He wait in silence. Struggle. Wait in silence. I can't do anything. I'm stuck at this stupid chair. Perhaps I should just wait and see what the hell is going on. I mean, someone should be here, right? You look around trying to see if there is anything that can help you break free. Uh, there must be something. There is a room. The room is kind of empty. Just boxes and drawers. Okay, you can skip here. There you go. Let me go. Try to attack him. Just let me go, man. Angry. You look at him with hatred in your eyes. Uh, let me go. Okay, I'm gonna... You can skip here. Apologize. Annoy him more. You what? Are you already starting to annoy me? Wait, you are making this hard. I'm trying to be nice to you, no? Don't make me teach you a lesson, Nori. You are so ungrateful. Tsk. Okay, okay. What did I say, dear? Begging will get you nowhere, Nori. He attempts to softly stroke your hair 
but you bite. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Annoy him more. You deserve it. Who do you think you are? When your own people notice I'm gone, they will look for me. No, uh, we can skip here. Coming soon. Fine, fine. Well, act appropriately. What's your name? Did you say we know each other? Okay, this is where the part where he asks us if we know each other. Try to go to boxes and makes him untie you. Even if I try to eat boxes, yeah, we did try it. It didn't help us at all. I eat at special pace. A uh, special pace. Yeah. Yes. If I eat too slowly, I will have a stomach ache. If I eat too fast, I will throw up. I have to eat by myself. But darling... I know everything about... Okay. We cannot fool him. Everything. I followed you everywhere. I know you have... I know how you eat. I know when you sleep. I know when you go out for a walk. I know your entire life. Okay. You are starting to... Freak us, man. How long have you been stalking me? Years. From the moment I fall in love with you. So don't try to fool me. I will feed you. Oh, this dude. I'm going to get the food now. Wait and be quiet. Wait here and be quiet. This freak. He walks slowly to the door and goes upstairs closing the doors behind him. How did I not notice it until now? How blind I am. And how the hell did he get into my house? Yeah. Hello, you are hungry. I made this specially for you. Okay, this is what he made. We can skip. What? What in here? Oh, the collar. Is there a way for us? Hmm... When did I say yes or no to him? Oh yeah, here. Okay, fine, man. We can skip it. If we attack him, he will hate us. Don't attack him. Don't do anything. He removed the chair. Yeah, skip it. What about the fridge? What about the shower? Yeah, what about the shower, man? What about the shower? I have to take a shower. I don't want to smell like a rotting zombie. Yeah, man, I already thought about it. I will take you upstairs to the shower. It's a special bath made for you. You will not be able to escape. At least I will be, I will be clean. Uh-huh, wait, hold up. Is he... You will let me shower alone, right? No. Huh? What do you mean? <laughs> oh, he makes fun of me. He makes fun of me. Of course I will let you shower alone, darling. The bathroom has no exit in a way. The bathroom has only one door. But you will wear handcuffs. Handcuffs. How should I shower while wearing handcuffs? And you'd better not try anything. Also, if you behaving well, I'll give you a few surprises. What of surprise? What kind of surprise? You will see. Okay, actually, tomorrow I have a surprise for you. I swear if, if another call... Okay, okay, you can skip it here. Did you have good grades, Nori? Okay. Uh... What if I said yes? I thought I had pretty good grades. Oh, really? I see you remember quite a few things from the past. That's good. Let's continue. Why is he asking about my about high school again? Did you have friends in high school? They, well, I'm gonna go with this. They weren't my friends. I mean, 
I've talked to a quite few people, but I don't consider them my friends, more like classmates, people I know. Even your seatmate, you two were quite close. He was just my seatmate. Whatever you say, Nori. Anyway, now for the last question. Do you miss seeing your state seatmate? Okay. Okay, I can skip here. Uh, I'm gonna look around. Okay, he slams. This is where he slammed the door. Okay, fine. I can hear you out. Yeah, I can skip now. Hold my hand, just leave me. Okay, hold my hands. Okay, hold my hands. This is where he holds my hands. Uh, can you untie me? I promise that you will give you a chance. Okay, I can skip here. We really want to have some soda. Yeah. What about the soda, man? Not very healthy, you know that. Uh, so I'm not allowed to eat or have my... Yeah, man. They will get all that to the nurse. Skip it. You should. Okay, I'm gonna wait for you, man. I did. Escaped. Ah. Huh. I think I'll be staying here. I'll keep my words and trust him for now. I'll give him a chance to prove, prove to me that he can be better. If he fails, I'm out of here. I should have remained him to give me some crayons. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay. I'm starting to get bored. Yeah, let's skip it. Make origami. Read the book. Uh, which one, guys? Make origami. Skip it. Page with flowers, page with panda. What about panda? Well, it's just one page, and I don't like it that much anyway. And it's not like I can I can draw it. Well, let's see. You sit down and try to make the origami. Skip it. Is it the same origami? Oh, it's the same. Like shuriken. Yeah, I know. I'm back. Uh, you can't have it. Throw it. You can have it. You can have it. Wait, really? Yeah, I mean it. It's not the best, but I tried. Really? Why, why the hell are you crying, man? Because you, you are giving me something you created with your own hands. It's not a big deal. Here, take it. Okay, he's happy. It's so beautiful. So amazing. So perfect. Why does it have a big mark? What mark? What mark, man? Doesn't matter. Take it or leave it. I will keep it forever. It's my in my backpack, so you are always with me wherever I go. Damn. Okay. Anyway, here is your request, your majesty. Oh, okay, we got our... I bought you the soda you wanted. It's your favorite. I thought you, you forgot. How can I forget your favorite soda? Never, your majesty. So cheesy. <laughs> always with you. So, I was thinking maybe you want to enjoy soda while watching a movie. Okay, I can't skip, skip here. What movie? I thought maybe, um, maybe you want to watch a movie with me tonight. I think we should be do activities like this, you know, getting to know each other. Okay. Uh, what if I said love you too? Love you too. Okay. You do? You do? How? When? What? Oh my god. Uh, 
my God, I'm so happy. You made me the happiest today, darling. I love you so much. I'm going to prepare the movie and the popcorn. Relax here until then. He quickly goes upstairs, slamming the door and starts running. Damn, he's really happy. Yeah, he's like a like a happy child. After a few minutes, he finally returned. Huh. Are you ready to go up, honey? Yeah. I have I have to handcuff you. Stay still. Ah, uh, okay, okay. There you go. It's not too tight, is it? It's comfortable, is it comfortable? Yes. Okay, let's Okay, I'm gonna come for him. It's okay. He's just a fictional character in a movie. He can't hurt you. But what if he really exists? He doesn't. And he is in Weisenberg. If he really exists, you are safe. I guess you are right. Can you turn the light? Uh-oh, nine, nine, man. Okay. Shush. Here he comes, interesting part. Hug him. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna hug you, man. He really looks like a scared cat. Do you want a hug? Wait, why would me give you a hug? Yes, come here. <laughs> he hugs you, still shaking. I didn't know you were a scared cat. <laughs> I'm, I'm not. L just watch. <laughs> okay, he's crying now. God, you scared me. What the hell? She says, sorry, Nori. I, I thought bodies. The, the, uh, turn, turn, let's turn on the light. No, hell no. The movie is almost over. You can hold on a little longer. I will try. See? It's already over. The movie is said based on a true story. He is real. It's just to make the story more creepy. I can, we can skip here. <laughs> Go to the bed. Uh huh. Give me a new chance for real. Okay, fine. If he try to escape, he gonna kill us. You know what? I think I'm getting a touch. And he's really kind. I will truly accept him. A long time ago, really needed a chance. But even my partner didn't give it to me. How could I give a chance? I have a chance when I can't give others a chance. I'm sure everything will be fine from now on. Good night, Leonor. Day 4. Okay. I feel so good in this bed. It's so comfortable. Okay, it is a comfortable bed. Good morning, Noi. I can't believe you slept next to me without trying to kill me or suffocate me or try to escape. Don't tr don't you trust me? Of course I trust you, my dear. Just surprised. If I were you, I don't think I'd give the freak a chance. Anyway, I have no other choice. You had, but you didn't take the chance. Hey, Noi, were you serious then? What? You really love me? Well, I think I'm starting to accept you in my life. Not really, love, love you. You know what I mean? What I meant? I see. This is going better than I expected. How? I expected you to be more of a brat. Try to escape every second you are alone. Maybe even try to kill me or something. I would have done that if I had the chance. But you actually accepted to give me a chance. I, I love you, Nori. I promise to make you the happiest. Hug you know. I want to hug you. I guess you deserve one of these. You approach him and attempt to give him a hug before he can respond. Your hands are locked, but you settle. Your head in his shoulders. Mm. You, you hugged me. Shocked and embarrassed, 
He looks at you.、Uh, why did you hug me? Because I wanted to, I guess. You really didn't lie about that chance, did you? As you can see, no. I believe you. I trust you. And I love you, Noi. I will untie you. And you can start living like a normal lover. s No more basements, chains, shackles, or other things. You promise? I swear. Okay, he is happy. Oh, okay, chill. I love you, Noi. You won't regret. Stay with Luno. One year later. What happened? What happened, man? You know. Why did you order so many trading cards? We ran we run a grocery store. Come on, darling. You know, everyone loves it. You know, people after driving 10 kilometers won't stop the store at the store to get trading cards, right? Why not? I would. Huh? I love you, but sometimes you act like you are five years old. I love you too, darling. We didn't do a little grocery store for a trading card. Please try not to buy 400 packs again. Okay. Next time I will order only 200. What the? Okay. By the way, my dear. Oh, okay. Happy anniversary. I love you. I loved you in the past. I love you in the present and future. I will love you forever. I love you too. Is this the kind? Good end. Okay. Thank you for playing. I still want to see what if I did that to him. Hmm. You know what? You move closer to him, and before he can pull away, you kiss him. He pulls back and looks at you in a shock and embarrassment. What was that? I told you I love you. Do you believe me now?、Uh, yes, but.、Uh, but. But what? Isn't that what you wanted? It was, but I wanted to do it with your heart. A real kiss. It was a real kiss. I believed. I believe you, my dear. I. I will untie you. And you can start our life together as a normal couple. Thank you, Lino. Stay with Luna. It's the same thing, I guess. Yeah. Well, staying with the Pycopath was. How should I say? If I was there, I would have agreed in staying with him because he's a good Pycopath, not the bad one. Oh, okay. I didn't see that coming. But anyway, as long as we can control this biker pass, he's gonna be a good. The bad one can't, cannot be controlled. So, okay, thank you guys for watching. I hope I can see you in the next video. Bye bye.